guys, so today we're going to be making a tuna sandwich and we're using the Bumblebee brand. So I have some onions, red peppers, and green peppers that I'm gonna be sauteing. I also got some lettuce and I'm gonna be using some mayo. So first we're going to be seasoning our tuna just a little bit. You don't have to do this and you can also use any season you want. I'm also going in with a little bit of adobo. I'm also going in with some basil. And I'm going in with some black pepper. And I'm also going in with some salt. And a little bit of paprika. And then we're just going to be mixing. See, this is how it looks, not too much seasoning. So now we're just going to mix everything in and then we're going to start by sauteing the veggies first. So we're going to let this saute for just a little bit. Don't turn up your stove too high. We don't want this to burn because we also got to add the tuna. So we want our veggies to taste good. See? And now we're going to be adding our tuna to the pot. And now we're going to be combining this. We're going to give that some time to heat up, pretty much cook, before we put it in the bowl. That's how it looks. So now we're going in with our mayo. We're trying to get our tuna just to be a little bit more creamier. And then we're just going to be combining everything. Add a little bit more mayo. You no, know, everyone preference. So you can use any bread that you guys want. I'm just using regular bread and I'm just going to be putting the tuna on top and then I'm going to be putting the lettuce. You guys can also add like tomatoes, cucumbers, any other toppings you guys want or cheese. And I'm going in with some sweet chili sauce. And that's it. I'm also, I also pressed on my bread. You guys can also do that too. And this is the final result. It was quick, it was simple. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and share and I'll see you in my next video.